Another day, another clutch by default Sage. Just kidding. Look at the scoreboard. I'm currently 5 and 15 getting hard carried. I'm doing like a massive 69 damage per round. And this Silva probably needs to use his medical insurance after this game for breaking his back carrying us so hard. That said, currently on an eco round. Currently 10-10. We're going to execute on bomb site A here. So I do let the team know that, okay, help me get into bath. I'm going to fast plant on A, and we can watch the defusal from bath. So we head towards A. I'm going to follow chamber in. And let's see what happens here. Now, I will share that based off of what's been happening earlier in the game, Omen does play this angle pretty aggressively. For other Sage mains, if you throw a diagonal wall from this angle, you don't actually need to leave Bath to place the wall. So when you exit, you only need to clear the right side. So I'm going to immediately wall and then plant the spike here. You'll see that Raze does try to throw her grenade at us. I get the hell out of there. Now Reyna does teleport behind us. Thankfully, my Sova is in a flank position from short A. So he does kill the Reyna and he grabs that phantom. So I run to Sova to get his Sheriff. However, he is going to die here, so I'll take the Phantom instead. I do shoot Short A there to keep Raze there. And now we're down to a 2v1. You do hear the tap. I swing and get Raze. Now, we hear Omen teleport, but nobody's fooled because you can clearly see the circle where he's teleporting. So it's not like he crossed. So I'll, I'll be ready for it. So as he re-engages, I already know exactly where he's at. Thank you for watching, and I hope this can help you win some rounds.